let's um let's take a moment of silence for Tankbot Mark One, who is currently stuck on Minmus. Um, still receiving solar power via his solar cells, but um, unfortunately, no longer useful. Uh, cannot get really get any more science. Cannot actually go anywhere because anywhere else that he can go is unfortunately up a hill, and he cannot climb hills because he is in fact a hockey puck stuck on a big giant ball of mint ice cream. Maybe we'll see him again sometime. Anyway, onto the game. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea what we're doing. Let's see what missions we have. We need to get more science. That's that's a fact. And I'm and I'm still thinking that we still need to get some science from that science from uh, Minmus, possibly from the moon. Minmus is going to be <laughs> easier, definitely. Uh. Maybe we'll try a manned mission this time. So that we can actually bring the science home instead of having to transmit it. Let's see if there's anything, um... Yeah. I don't like that, I don't like that one. Uh... VIP... Land on the moon? Jesus, no, no. You're gonna have to pay a lot more than 25000 for moon landing, sir. Uh, Equatorial Orbit of Kerbin, which actually would not be that hard. What do I need? Has an antenna and can generate power, so antenna and solar power. Uh, solar panels, I mean. And then just get onto the correct orbit. I mean, this should, this should be really easy, right? Before we take it, I'll, I'll look and make sure it's not like a weird orbit. Uh, orbital station on a solar orbit? Um, no. I don't think that I'm ready for that yet. Explore Duna, I would like to do... I don't know if we're going to get there tonight. If we don't get there tonight, we should at least be able to get there. I mean, I would hope next week. Uh, okay, there's two of these. There's two of these? There's two of these for some reason. One of these pays a hell of a lot more money than the other one. Ten and generate power... As a materials bay. Okay, let's see where these are. We do need more money, that's for that's a fact. So, um Sean's that Sean's Connery. Is that is that what I'm supposed to be reading there? The uh, the agency. So this must be the more expensive one? The moving parts experts group? Ah crap. Maybe I should have actually looked and see. Alright, Sean, no, Sean's cannery is actually the the uh, more paying one. Look at that. I get, like, a lot of money for this. What was the other one? There's, like, barely any money for this one. Okay, you know what? Double check, make sure it's not weird. I'm, I'm worried it's gonna be, like, going the other way, but no, it's not actually going the other way. It's going this way, so it's going fine. So, yeah, we're gonna get this one. This one from uh... Sean's cannery. And we're going to do it. Because it should. And all we have to do is put a satellite with a materials bay. Seems easy enough to me. Uh, we'll get this eventually. But we're not ready for it yet. So what else do we have? Go on an orbital spacewalk near Minmus. Well, we'll do that if we do a manned mission. Um... This is a satellite in equatorial of the moon. Orbital space, we still need to do this, but it's expensive. Building space stations are, are expensive. Still need to do this one at some point, but we're going to do this one. We're going to do this easy, um, well, theoretically, it's easy. Equatorial orbit of Kerbin, because um, we need money. And then after we get money, we'll do a manned mission to Minmus, is what I'm thinking. We're going to have to build a new thing for that, though, probably, because I, I want to do weird things. Uh, let's shove a probe core on here. 
So I got uh, Kerbal Engineer Redux instead of MechJeb because I, I was not using MechJeb for any of its autopilot functions. I was only ever using it to see like my Delta V and stuff when I'm uh, when I'm building. So I figured might as well just go with KER since it's just updated. Uh, we need a materials bay, don't we? Let's see. It's an antenna. I have materials bay. So we do need materials bay. Let's, uh... That is this, right? Am I am I wrong about that? Oh, this is, uh, engineer. These are both the engineer, Kerbal Engineer stuff. Interesting. I'm not like, yeah, I'll observe materials, but yeah, okay. Now we need some, uh, poor. That's not it. Uh, let's do, let's do like two of these. Let's make this like, it look like a nice, uh, a nice, like, satellite, like an actual satellite. What do these look like? See, that's that looks that looks nice. We don't have the big ones yet. Uh, we might as well put a uh, a battery, two batteries on here too, just because you know. If I don't, I'm gonna be sorry. I'm sure. I'm sure about that. Uh, I wonder if I should actually put a fairing in here too. Uh. Set. Put these in a little bit. That looks nice. Fair? Okay. Let's do like this. And then let's, um, much? I don't think so. So this is it, right? This is all we need? I mean, for, for the actual satellite. I guess maybe we should, um, I mean, we are going to need some, some fuel, of course. Obviously. Uh, we're not going to need a lot of fuel once we're actually up there, so I'm thinking just this. Right? For the actual satellite? And not that one. Is it not that one? Yeah, this is it. Is there a better, um, how much does this have? 2733? 45, 55. I don't know. Would that be better? Worse? No, we'll just we'll just go with what we have. Um RCS fools. I mean I could use RCS instead, but that, that's like going to be more expensive. So no, this is going to be our satellite. This right here is going to be our satellite. How much fuel does this have? 45? How much Delta V does it have? Uh, 1,264. I, am I to assume that this is in space, right? Oh, here. So it's right here. Jeez. Uh, atmospheric is, yeah, but, but, but in space. See, that's, 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 Plenty, I should be plenty. Get a decoupler. Uh, this one? Yeah. Give me a nice, um... Give me a nice little kind of small rocket, I think. Hopefully. Hopefully it's not too expensive. Although we are getting, like, what, 170-some thousand for this? So... Uh, this is not going to be enough, but let me just see. Do I want some... Um, do I want... Two more liquid. By the way... I was going to turn... Turn the music down a little bit. That's okay. We'll do that after we're done. Making this. Uh, if I want more liquid, I could put like these on, right? I put these on and then feed them in. Uh, I should probably put some... Uh, these. Like, I don't know if I want actual, actually more engines, 
but I feel like I want more. No, that's not it. Uh, wait. Something like that. That didn't really help at all, did it? Uh, oh, you know what? That's why it didn't help at all, because... Um, Uh, so this will have a total of, was it like 32 or so? Which, um, <laughs> which number am I, am I, am I looking at? Does anyone know? Maybe it doesn't matter. This is 32. Uh, obviously we do need, um, some of... Which is these? 0.075 versus 0.03. Yeah, these are going to be better, I think. Probably. We are going to need fins as well. Actually, I should put some fins on before I decide that this is it. Uh, that fuel line is not is not good. Not good for this. Let's... um. Oops. Let's put it like up here. Uh, it, it doesn't matter if it's going up or down, does it? I don't think it does. Okay. Or about less, though makes me think that I should put a little bit more fuel. I wonder if I could just... Let me just do this. There. How much is that? That's like a lot. That's like 37. That's that's like more than enough. Uh, it's 14,000, but again, we are getting... I don't know how much. We're getting like a lot. And we might, you know, we may or may not need this to, um, we may or may not need the, the extra fuel to actually get into the correct orbit, because I think sometimes these can be really all kinds of, um, it's picky, very picky. I, 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 I want a reaction wheel, because, um, I don't trust probe cores anymore. Okay. And we have in, like infinite power. We have two batteries. It should be fine. So this is our uh what what is it? Is it geosynchronous? No, it's just equatorial orbit. Uh EO Robe. It's Captain EO. It's Michael Jackson is in here. Save this. Hopefully this will work. I mean, I guess we're going to find out. But if it doesn't work, we're only losing 15k, which is not horrible. We do have uh, Satan's amount of money, apparently, down there. So we should be fine. Our staging okay. It only has the one a rocket uh, up, un, up, you know, up until there, and then these will fall off, and then eventually this whole thing falls off when you use this. Uh, we can actually. Uh, I'm actually going to put this up here and put this. Oops. Because we can blow the fairing at any point once we're in space, and and I would think that we would be in space way before we use this. Um, rocket. Uh, I may even change it to be down below here at some point, but we'll see. We'll see how much fuel we use. Uh, let me exit here real quick. Uh, for one thing, the sound is just like a little bit too uh too, too loud. 
too high. Like, let's put it down like 8%. Eight, eight Get this down to uh, 20. I thought I turned stuff down earlier, but um, apparently not quite enough. Okay. Bye. Accept. Where are we going? So we're obviously, we're taking off. We're going to try not to, we're going to try real hard to take off exactly right. But we may not. We may have to adjust. Periapsis is 1,066,730. Epoapsis is 3,572,130. So we probably want to um, I don't know. We're going to take off. Where are we going to take off? We're like, yeah, we're like right around here, I think. All right? This is this is, this is is the uh, Kerbal Space Program right here. So we're going to take off and we're going to go up and we can pretty much just go as as high as as we care to go um on our initial uh takeoff we probably don't want to just waste all of our fuel in the atmosphere actually honestly we probably only want to get up to like 70 or 75 or something like that and then we'll um and then we'll just circularize our orbit orbit and then we'll we'll adjust from there i think is what uh is what we'll do let's actually do it shall we stay time Uh, we have good weather. Triple check what we need. Unmanned probe. Unmanned probe. Antenna. Oh, I forgot the antenna. Ooh, I almost forgot that, didn't I? Put antenna up here. Put it right here. Uh, right there in the middle. Is that okay? Yeah, actually, it is. Okay, it has an antenna. It can generate power because it has these uh, solar cells. Nope. A new unmanned probe built for Sean's cannery after the contract accepted, which which we have done. We have we built it after we accepted it. Reach the designated equatorial orbit, which we will do. Yeah, and then it tells what it is. But we'll just look at the map for that. Have a materials bay on the satellite, which we do this science junior and then we have to be there in there for 10 seconds which <laughs> pretty sure the satellite's going to be there for forever but uh but yeah save resave because we added that uh, antenna and uh see about uh, launching all right it is morning Let's, um, let's go. Oh, God. Oh, I really should, probably should have double-checked my thrust-to-weight ratio on this. Uh, we are going up, so... Probably okay. Okay, we don't want to... Maybe that might have been just a little bit too much of a turn. That indeed was a little bit too much of a turn. Because now we are going to, in fact, crash. Only 14k. It's fine. You know what? It's fine. Wow. I'm I I I can't actually really do anything right now. Like I'm pressing the buttons and it's basically barely not. It's it's not okay. This is going to be a long crash. <laughs> it is going to crash. It looks like. Right in the ocean. There we go. Come on. Go on down. I think I put that reaction wheel in there. That's really making a huge difference. Okay. Well, we didn't lose anyone. We just lost 15,000 smackaroos. No reverting because there was no bug.